It wasn't so long ago that the whole world paused. Like everyone else, BC's film industry put down their tools and halted all production, with no idea when they would return. After months of uncertainty, hours of screen time, and hundreds of meetings, BC's film and television industry got back to work, thanks to the determination, creativity, and teamwork of so many. Like our small business owners, opening doors to film crews and giving us unique and important backdrops to tell our stories. And our friends and neighborhood allies who welcome filming in BC's amazing communities. Not to mention our local government partners who work closely with our industry while balancing community needs and keeping safety a number one priority. The same goes for our hardworking cast and crew members from prep to post who follow the protocols that keep us healthy, screened and sanitized so we can safely deliver the content we all crave. But we wouldn't be back to work without the real heroes, our frontline workers and public health officers who've worked relentlessly to keep us safe. Thank you for everything you do. And cut! That's a wrap, everyone! Good work, everyone. Welcome to the 2021 Leo Awards, our 23rd annual celebration of excellence in British Columbia film and television. We hope these three nights of presentations provide a gentle reminder that our community remains strong and resilient. I would like to acknowledge the Indigenous nations on whose ancestral lands we live, work, and gather on throughout the province. The Leo Awards are governed by the Motion Picture Arts and Sciences Foundation of British Columbia. I'd like to thank and acknowledge our Board of Trustees who give generously of their time and their resources. Thank you to all of our sponsors, in particular our major sponsors, Creative BC, ACFC West, IATSE 891, and the BC branch of the Directors Guild of Canada, as well as our supporting sponsors, Company 3, Crafty Apes, Finale Post Picture Shop Vancouver, the International Cinematographers Guild, Local 669, Peak Technologies, and the Union of BC Performers, ACTRA. I'd also like to thank all of our jurors, 72 in total this year, many of whom spent upwards of two months screening, adjudicating over 1,100 entries in 15 different program categories. Filmmaking is a team sport. We don't just work together, we also support one another by going to screenings, by spreading the word about crowdfunding campaigns, by liking all the short film Facebook pages your friends make. We want to see others succeed because we know that means we're succeeding too. Filmmaking isn't just about what you know, it's also about who you know. So let's continue building a community that is welcoming and supportive, where we lift each other up and help tell stories that matter. On behalf of all of us at the Leo Awards, congratulations to all the nominees and award recipients. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Melanie Mark. My Niska name is Lahai Kwiskak and I'm very proud to be BC's Minister of Tourism, Arts, Culture and Sport. I want to acknowledge the traditional homelands of the Musqueam, Squamish and Tsleil-Waututh Nations 
for which I'm sharing these greetings and to acknowledge the territory that you're participating uh, to watch the virtual 23rd annual LEO Awards. I want to start by congratulating all of the nominees and recipients and to thank you for your resilience. I know that this last year has been incredibly challenging, but I know it didn't stop you from pushing the envelope, being the storytellers, being the truth tellers. It is so important that we continue to shine here in BC with our film and TV industry. We are making our mark across North America, around the world because of our BC talent. Tonight, we celebrate you, we celebrate your achievements, we celebrate everyone um, that is involved in making our motion picture industry so successful. And I, I guess my wish for you as minister is that we have a really positive future ahead of us, that we continue being resilient, pushing the envelope as a government, as a society, and that we continue to support those jobs that are so vitally important to us. Congratulations, everyone. Enjoy your night. I know it's not the red carpet event that you are normally used to, but those days are coming. Have a good night. Ladies and gentlemen, your host for this evening's award ceremony, Carmen Moore. Denise, Sakaize, Skaize, Saisozi, Carmen Moore, welcome to night two of the 2021 Leo Awards. I'll be your host this evening celebrating the achievements of our film and television community. As we all know, stories are important. And as we're about to see tonight, we all tell different stories in many different ways. And all of these stories help audiences learn and feel. They open people's eyes and teach empathy towards others. That's why it's so important to have diverse storytellers in the industry. We all experience the world in different ways, and one of the best ways to teach others about ourselves is through art. We need stories from persons with disabilities, from different racial backgrounds, sexual orientations, gender identifications. We need to hear from those who have continually been silenced by society. We need the film and television industry to reflect our diverse world in order for us to fully understand each other and make sense of it. The Leo Awards exist to celebrate artistic achievement within our film and television community, and we hope you're all as proud to be here as we are to have you. Congratulations to all of the nominees and award recipients. Thank you. The nominees in the category of Best Picture Editing in a Music, Comedy, or Variety Program or Series are Simon Firminger, 2020 UBCP ATRA Awards Red Carpet Special. Daniel Krieger, Julie and the Phantoms, Finally Free. Lisa Jane Robeson, Loudermilk, When I'm Alone. And the Leo Award goes to Lisa Jane Robeson, Loudermilk, When I'm Alone. Hi, I just want to um, thank everybody at the Leos and uh, Sunny, Walter, all the jurors. Uh, thank you so much for all your time. And the sponsors, uh, thank you for all that you do for the Leos uh, all these years. Um, my fellow nominees, uh, it's a tough category and I respect the work you do and I love the work you do. Um, I also want to thank Bobby Farrelly, Peter Farrelly, Don Knight, uh, Lisa Fan Flowers, and my partner, Lisa Binkley. Thank you very much. The nominees in the category of Best Screenwriting in a Music, Comedy, or Variety Program or Series are Jenica Harper, Leah Goche, Jan, What Did Jan Do? Sonia Bennett, Letter Kenny, Scorched Earth. And the Leo Award goes to Sonia Bennett, Letter Kenny, Scorched Earth. The nominees in the category of Best Direction in a Music, Comedy, or Variety Program or Series are Luke Vandervert, Marika Seward, Christmas at Our House with Brian Dorkson and Friends, Adam Kennedy, On Stage, The Town Pants Live at Glassfest. And the Leo Award goes to Luke Vandervert, Marika Seward, Christmas at our house with Brian Dorkson and friends. 
Thank you so much. Um, you know, I want to first of all just thank Walter, Sunny, the Leo's team just for celebrating our talent and our, our BC talent. Um, I want to thank our cast, our crew, our band, to Brian and Joyce Dirksen, Christopher Greco, Philip Jans for believing that we could pull this off. Um, we wanted to create a show of hope during a time that felt very hopeless, so we're really grateful for this. Um, personally, I just want to thank my agents and my teams, Esther Cohen, Brenda Campbell, Mina Masood, Alan Mashiaki, and the EDA Foundation for supporting ethnic artists Let's see more of that here in BC and in Canada. Um, to Stacey, Zach, Jade, and Zoe, you're my world. Stay focused, everyone. Live on purpose and shine on. Thank you, guys. The nominees in the category of Best Performance in a Music, Comedy, or Variety Program or Series are Sharon Taylor, Jan, Last Straws, Andrea Bang, Kim's Convenience, Appa and Linus, Carmel Amet, Louder Milk, Hit Me Baby One More Time, Fiona Forbes, On Stage, The Isolation Sessions with Baldi. And the Leo Award goes to Sharon Taylor, Jam, Last Straws. The nominees in the category of Best Music, Comedy or Variety Program or Series are 2020 UBCP ACTRA Awards Red Carpet Special, Sabrina Firminger, Paul Firminger, Sue Brouse, Producers. Jan, Andrew Barnsley, Benjamin Murray, Jenica Harper, Leah Gauthier, Jan Arden, Tom Cox, Jordy Randall, Randy Lennox, Dean Bennett, Producers, Kim's Convenience, Yvonne Fetzan, Alec Raffi, Inns Choi, Kevin White, Producers, On Stage, Peter Young, Fiona Forbes, Producers. And the Leo Award goes to Kim's Convenience, Yvonne Fitzsaint, Alex Raffi, Inns Choi, Kevin White, Producers. Break a leg out there? Huzzah! Huzzah! Shock only lasts so long, so pitter patter. Oh, yeah! The nominees in the category of Best Performance Male in a Web Series are Alex Ponovic, Narcoleap, Kelsey's Choice, Madison Smith, Narcoleap, Kelsey's Choice, Austin Eckert, Narcoleap, Tripwire, and the Leo Award goes to Austin Eckert, Narcoleap, Tripwire. The nominees in the category of Best Performance Female in a Web Series are Chelsea Reist, Narcoleap, Kelsey's Choice, Nicole Oliver, Narcoleap, Sanctuary, and the Leo Award goes to Nicole Oliver, Narcoleap, Sanctuary. <laughs> sit down, sit down, sit down. in the category of best web series are All In Three, a Fakowski and Belner documentary, Tyler Hines, S.J. Finley, Josh Husilek, producers, Narcoleap, Kate Green, John Cooksey, Amber Orchard, producers. And the Leo Award goes to Narcoleap, Kate Green, John Cooksey, Amber Orchard, producers. TV, John Cooksey, the most amazing writing mentor that I've had, and of course the beautiful Amber Orchard, who took <laughs> on producing this series with grace and determination. And the fearless kids. Thank you so yes, much. Yes, and you. Thank you. Oh, and it's my anniversary today, so thank you to Jason, my husband, for sticking with me for 14 years. Woo! Woo! It's been a weird 15 months, hasn't it? I know you're all sick of hearing it, but then so am I. 
but it feels like we're on the precipice of exciting change. We're seeing a light at the end of the tunnel. Fingers crossed, knock on wood. Hopefully I'm not jinxing anything. Anyways, you know what? We're ready. We've spent so much time with each other online that at this point, I don't even remember how tall anyone is. And if I see someone I know outside of Zoom and they're not wearing that same Hawaiian shirt, I could barely recognize them. And at this point, I still can't quite fathom the idea of hugging people or shaking hands or high-fiving, but I'm preparing myself. I'm in training. So as we get closer to the finish line and we get excited for things to get back to somewhat normal, I think we should celebrate that. And I think we should also celebrate the fact that this will hopefully be the last time we ever have to host a virtual Leo Awards. Let's celebrate that. Next year, we will all hopefully be together in one room together, surrounded by the people that we love and people that we hate and some people we can't stand and others we don't know but creeped online. Sorry about that. But we'll be together in the same room, breathing the same air, clinking our glasses together and partying our faces off. Because, let's be real, we've all been holed up uh, for the last 15 months at home and we are ready to party. So let's make tonight one of the best last online parties we've seen in months. Congratulations to all the nominees and award recipients. And thank you for continuing to support BC Talent. Woo! Could be a trap. It's probably a trap. The nominees in the category of Best Sound in an Animation Series are Marcel Dupereau, Jason Fredrickson, Todd Araki, Kirk Furness, Adam McGee, Christine Church, Carmen San Diego, The Dark Red Caper, Ewan Dean, Nolan McNaughton, Jamie Mahaffey, Maureen Murray, Wes Swales, Dave Hibbert, Lego Marvel Avengers, Climate Conundrum, Red Skull Rising, Jeff Davis, Steph and Cecilia, Fanny Regidal, Ninjago, The Speedway 5 Billion, Todd Araki, Marcel Dupereau, Jason Fredrickson, Adam McGee, Andrew Downton, The Snoopy Show, Better Off Beagle. And the Leo Award goes to Ewan Dean, Nolan McNaughton, Jamie Mahaffey, Maureen Murphy, Wes Swales, Dave Hibbert, Lego Marvel Avengers, Climate Conundrum, Red Skull Rising. Hey, I wasn't expecting uh, to be accepting this. It's too bad Ewan isn't here, but Ewan uh, put together the team. He was a supervisor and re-recording mixer. Um, yeah, and Atomic Cartoons. Uh, myself, Jamie, Maureen, Wes, and Dave all on the team. Yeah, thanks so much, guys. We're super stoked. It was an awesome series and looking forward to season two. The nominees in the category of Best Musical Score in an Animation Series are... Matt Davis, ABC with Kenny G, JKL. Marcello Eugenio Trevino, The Last Kids on Earth, June Gloom. And the Leo Award goes to Matt Davis, ABC with Kenny G, JKL. Hey, um, thanks for this Leo <laughs> Awards. Um, I want to thank Marcus Mosley, the amazingly talented voice of Kenny G. Um, I want to send a big thanks to Shabnam Razai, the show creator, um, and also to Mai and Patty and everyone at Big Bad Boo who works on the show, and uh, personal thanks to my amazing wife, Sarah, and our little goober, Reese, and my cat, Javier. Thank you. The nominees in the category of Best Screenwriting in an Animation <laughs> Series are Andrew Carr, Corner Gas Animated, Pack Rat, Brent Butt, Jennifer Siddle, Corner Gas Animated, Remembers Only. Dennis Capoten, Diana Moore, Dennis and Me, Lemonade Standoff. And the Leo Award goes to Andrew Carr, Corner Gas Animated, Packed Rat. The nominees in the category of Best Direction in an Animation Series are Jose Humphrey, Mike West, Flavia Gutler, 
Carmen Sandiego, The Dark Red Caper. Andrew Duncan, Kieran Sangara, Go Dog Go, Cocky Day, Take Me Out to the Fetch Game. Ken Cunningham, Lego Marvel Avengers, Climate Conundrum, Wild Weather. Richard Johnson, Daniel Ife. Ninjago, The Son of Lily. Steve Evangelados, Bazad Mansouri, Rid Sorensen, Rob Battalier, The Snoopy Show, Happiness is a Dancing Dog. And the Leo Award goes to Ken Cunningham, Lego Marvel Avengers, Climate Conundrum, Wild Weather. Wow, um, thanks, such an honor. Uh, so many people to thank, my partners at Lego, uh, Jason Kosler, um, all my team at Atomic, um, yeah, just so many people. And of course, the Leo Awards. Uh, thank you so much. The nominees in the category of Best Art Direction in an Animation Series are Kenny Yang, Ninjago, Superstar Rockin' J, Amy He, Polly Pocket, Princess Predicament, Lost and Unfound, Alexia Trifon, The Last Kids on Earth, June Gloom. And the Leo Award goes to Kenny Yang, Ninjago, Superstar Rockin' J. Uh, so I am not Kenny Ng, I'm Ryan Perez, the producer on Ninjago, and I'm very happy to accept this on behalf of Kenny, who couldn't attend tonight. Uh, I want to congratulate the other nominees, Alexia and Amy. Uh, very cool to see everyone nominated in this category and across all the categories. The quality of work is just awesome. Um, so this season, we had to put Ninjago into a video game world, which was a huge challenge because it's pretty far removed from what Ninjago usually is. But Kenny did a fantastic job of helping uh, visualize what this needed to be through the design and asset creation and all the way into lighting and effects. And it was really cool to see all of this come together and kind of blow away Lego's expectations for the season. A uh, huge thanks needs to go to the design team that worked alongside Kenny, uh, also the modeling and surfacing team, uh, the lighting and effects team, because really everyone worked so well together to bring this vision to life. And I need to thank Lego uh, for being the absolute best collaborators we could ever ask for, and Wildbrain for being just such an awesome place to work. And finally, thank you to the Leo Awards. Uh, this is a huge honor, and I'm super proud of Kenny. Thank you. The nominees in the category of Best Voice Performance in an Animation Series are Marcus Mosley, ABC with Kenny G, JKL, Nancy Robertson, Corner Gas Animated, Float Your Boat, Brent Butt, Corner Gas Animated, Sound and Fury. Chance Hurstfield, Dorg Van Dango, Dorg vs. Dorg. Brent Miller, Ninjago, Ninjago Confidential. Faye Wren, Robot Chicken, Babe Holly Tree in I Wish One Person Had Died. And the Leo Award goes to Nancy Robertson, Corner Gas Animated, Float Your Boat. The nominees in the category of Best Animation Series are Corner Gas Animated, Brent Butt, Virginia Thompson, David Story, Producers, Dorg Van Dango, Paul Young, Jerry Sheeran, Josh Sherba, Ann Loy, Kristen Newlands, James Brown, Naraya Gonzalez Blanco, Tom Moore, Katya Schumann, Producers, Lego Marvel Avengers, Climate Conundrum, Jason Kosler, Kalia Chang Ramirez, Jennifer Twiner McCarran, Steve Grover, Dan Langlois, Producers, The Last Kids on Earth, Max Browler, Scott Peterson, Matthew Berkowitz, Jennifer Twiner McCarran, Joel Bradley, Producers, The Snoopy Show, Josh Sherba, Ann Loy, Stephanie Betts, Paige Braddock, Charles Schultz, Mark Evanstaff, Kimberly Small, Producers. And the Leo Award goes to The Snoopy Show, Josh Sherba, Anne Loy, Stephanie Betts, Paige Braddock, Charles Schultz, Mark Ebstaff, Kimberly Small, Producers. 
Wow, thank you so much, everyone. <laughs> and on behalf of the producing team, I'd like to thank the Leo Awards and our partners, Creative Associates and Apple and Wild Brain for being so supportive. Thanks, Steph and Amir for everything. And I'd really love to thank the team, Mark Eastaff, our showrunner, and everyone from the writers and voice performers to our incredible talent at the Vancouver studio. Too many people to name, but all of the directors Boots and Rid and Bez and Steve and production, Ayla, all the way through our design and boards and, you know, animation, BGs, I, boards, I can't name you all, but uh, I can't thank you enough. So um, thanks for coming together for your individual contributions and incredibly challenging time to create this beautiful show. Thank you. As the world continues to open up and we find ways to get back to the normal we once knew, let's not forget what was important to us as we were forced to be apart finding new ways to connect. We phoned, we FaceTimed, we Zoomed and house partied, we WhatsApped, G-chatted, and maybe even some of us Skyped. And those people are probably still waiting for their call to buffer. Connection became paramount in any way we knew how. Being apart showed us how much it means for us to be together and how important we really are to one another. But it also showed us how important the things we create are. We watched movies and shows, read books, listened to music. We connected through art because there was nothing else left for us to do. I mean, for crying out loud, some people took the time to rewatch all 118 episodes of Lost because it provided them not only with the escape they needed, but with the connection. The connection of a great story except for the final season, of course, but we won't talk about that. So as we get to be face to face again, let's celebrate those that helped us get through this. Not just the people, but the art too, and those that made it. Let's thank them all for making us laugh and letting us cry. And let's strive to tell the types of stories that people will wanna spend hours binging when they have nothing else to do. Let's tell stories so good that people won't even feel compelled to try to make sourdough ever again. She was kind and funny and strong and smart. She was transferred by White Star Line from the Majestic to Titanic and sadly did not survive the sinking. Maybe some part of me will always be missing and I'll never be able to find it. When you're a guest at the Ralston Inn, you're automatically a member of the family. Ah. The nominees in the category of Best Sound in an Animation Program are Alvin Jalali, Eternal Igloo, Justin O'Coin, Try to Fly, and the Leo Award goes to Alvin Jalali, Eternal Igloo. Uh, I cannot tell you how happy I am that through my music, I could tell a story the frightening future we will face going in the same direction we currently are. Thank you all for hearing it. And I urge everyone here tonight to take actions starting now. Thank you. The nominees in the category of best musical score in an animation program are Alvin Jalali, Eternal Igloo, Daniel Seglin, Try to fly. And the Leo Award goes to Alvin Jalali, Eternal Igloo. Thank you again. I'm so happy. Wow, thank you. The nominees in the category of Best Screenwriting in an Animation Program are Louise Moon, Paw Patrol, Jet to the Rescue, Leon Lee, Ragdoll, the Alfolter Brothers, Simone Swan, Try to Fly. And the Leo Award goes to Leon Lee, Ragdoll. Oh, uh, thank you to the uh, Leo Awards. Uh, Ragdoll uh, tells the story of a five-year-old girl who uh, lost her mother due to uh, persecution by the Chinese regime. She is determined to uh, bring her mother back to life through the magic of art. The film is inspired by a true story. So if you're interested, you can now watch it on uh, ragdollfilm.com. I hope the story will uh, resonate with you and I hope you would help to uh, share with your family and, uh, and friends. Thank you so much.
The nominees in the category of Best Direction in an Animation Program are Ken Cunningham, Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry. Ken Cunningham, Lego Star Wars Holiday Special. Anne-Marie Fleming, Old Dog. Leon Lee, Ragdoll. The Affolter Brothers, Try to Fly. And the Leo Award goes to Leon Lee, Ragdoll. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, the, the film was uh, four years in the making. So a uh, heartfelt thank you to the very small crew who often worked on evenings and weekends to bring this film to life. Uh, special thanks to uh, Martin Munier, uh, Ken Burton, Justin Cohen, and, and uh, Sean Newton. Thanks a lot. The nominees in the category of Best Art Direction in an Animation Program are Mustafa Keshvari, Sanam Jokar Naragi, Eternal Igloo, Kevin Chai, Lego Star Wars Holiday Special, Kevin Langdale, Old Dog, Martin Mounier, Ragdoll, The Affolter Brothers, Try to Fly. And the Leo Award goes to Martin Mounier, Ragdoll. The nominees in the category of Best Voice Performance in an Animation Program are Alex Sahara, Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry. Durendra, Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry. Ian Hanlon, Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry. Alex Kleiner, Old Dog. Simone Swan, Try to Fly. And the Leo Award goes to Ian Hanlon. Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry. Wow, uh, th uh, this is very surprising. Um, I just want to say thank you and congratulations to all my fellow nominees. Um, obviously, Lego Jurassic World was very much an ensemble cast. Um, thank you to our director, James Corrigal. Uh, thank you to my agent, uh, Jamie Levitt, and everyone at LLA, uh, Jack, Harrison, Megan. Thanks for letting me stick around when I didn't book anything for the first several years. Um, thanks, everybody. <laughs> the nominees in the category of Best Animation Program are Lego Jurassic World Double Trouble Part 2, Sibling Rivalry, Jason Kostler, Jennifer Twiner McCarran, Steve Grover, Dan Langlois, Producers, Lego Star Wars Holiday Special, James Waugh, Josh Rimes, Jackie Lopez, Daniel Kevy, Jason Kostler, Jennifer Twiner McCarran, Steve Grover, Dan Lanois, Producers, Molly of Denali, Molly and the Great One, Dorothea Gillum, Princess Desrai Johnson, Kathy Waugh, Marcy Gunther, Olabunmi Mia Ofemi, Biz Thornson, Heather Rennie, Cassie O'Connor, Joel Bradley, Producers, Ragdoll, Leon Lee, producer. Try to Fly, Thomas Afolter, Heath Afolter, John Afolter, Nathan Afolter, Sheila Peacock, Paige Murray, producers. And the Leo Award goes to Ragdoll, Leon Lee, producer. Oh, that's uh, so amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I want to share one uh, little uh, behind the scenes story. The film is called Ragdoll because a well-known brand of doll from Italy was actually made in a Chinese labor camp by children whose parents were persecuted. So I, I hope uh, you have a chance to watch the film on ragdollfilm.com and uh, help to shed a light on, on their plight. Thank you. Over the past 15 months, everyone has had to pivot and our industry has been no exception. We've had to find new ways to do things to ensure the health and safety of everyone on set. Producers have had to add items to their budgets that they never have before. Face masks, bulk hand sanitizer, and laser thermometers. Craft services and catering have had to find creative ways to keep us well-fed with individually wrapped meals and snacks. 
cast and crew have had to brave numerous swabs stuck up their noses, and actors have had to get used to rinsing with mouthwash before any sort of intimacy. Though, can we just make that a common practice across the board? And we've had to go to work every day trusting that those around us are being honest about how they're feeling. What if we'd been doing that before? What if feeling unhealthy, whether physical or mental, was less taboo and we were more open to talking about it and finding ways to help those who aren't feeling great? Going forward, let's continue to keep health and safety a priority. Let's make sure everyone is getting the protection and treatment they need to do their jobs well. Let's remember that we are all doing tough jobs with very long hours and that it's okay for us not to be okay every day. As we pivot once again to a world where we don't need the masks or as much hand sanitizer or as many temperature checks, let's not forget how important health and safety is and that it should always, always, always come first. Overworked, underslept, can't catch up, can't slow down, or I'll make simple mistakes. I never knew what he did, why he left, how he died, any of it. You show me what you're made of right here, right now! This is my home, where I live. No, 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 wait. I'm not worth it. The nominees in the category of best makeup in a short drama are Graydon Van Erkellens, Murphy's Law, Sabrina Mori, We All Dream, and the Leo Award goes to Sabrina Mori, We All Dream. The nominees in the category of Best Costume Design in a Short Drama are Karina Barros, Freya, Bryce Calder, The Substitute, Matea Pesarek, Tsunami Falls, and the Leo Award goes to Bryce Calder, The Substitute. <laughs> Uh, wow, I want to thank my uh, producer for for nominating me for this. I want to thank my family, of course. Um, wow, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I um, am super thankful to the, all the faculty at CAP who gave me the opportunity to do this film whilst I was in school. It was life changing and this is, I am very, I'm internally grateful for this. Thank you so much. The nominees in the category of Best Production Design in a Short Drama are Shelby Wilson, Glow Doris, Jamie Schrest, Freya, Gabrielle Peterson, Happiness, Jenny Kim, The Substitute, Lacey Olson, The Tailor, Mo Curtin, This is a Period Piece. And the Leo Award goes to Jamie Schrest, Freya. Thank you so much. This is, I did not expect this. Um, and this was a, a serious team effort. I'm surrounded by wonderful people um, who this belongs to. So I guess the only thing I need to do is thank my living room. <laughs> my living room got me through a lot this year. Uh, and also it was the first thing that I ever drew and designed. So um, thanks to Brianna Rayner for giving me my first gig and everybody, this is awesome. Uh, make your art. Thank you. The nominees in the category of best sound in a short drama are Noah Meyer, Alone in the Arctic Skies. Will Ross, Kirby Jenna, Hackademia. Nolan McNaughton, Into the Night. Eli Helagua, Heaney Britton, Fatih Ragbet, Michael Keeping, Rosa Coe, Mr. James is Dead, Nolan McNaughton, Pelican Milkshake, David Duad, Kobe DeGroot, Soul, and the Leo Award goes to Eli Helagua, Heaney Britton, Fatih Ragbet, Michael Keeping, Rosa Coe, Mr. James is Dead. Thank you very much to the Leo Awards and producers and directors of the movie. It was lots of fun to work on that movie. And I want to congratulate all, all, all fellow nominees. Uh, they were really strong nominees. It was honored to have this award. 
and Hini. Thank you very much. And I uh, just want to say thank you to Jesus for giving us the creativity to work on this program. And uh, thanks to everybody that helped us and all that. Thank you very much. The nominees in the category of Best Musical Score in a Short Drama are Matthew Rogers, Babalu, Jeremy Wallace McLean, Cake Day, Marta Jasebek McKeever, Lucid, Mario Beria, Murphy's Law, Matt Dunsey, Old Fox, John Russell, We All Dream. And the Leo Award goes to Matthew Rogers, Babalu. The nominees in the category of Best Visual Effects in a Short Drama are Jason McKinley, Chris McKinley, Robin Waity, David Scott Titus, Freya, Bogdan Kondryuk, Hackademia, Riley Gray, Mr. James is Dead. And the Leo Award goes to Jason McKinley, Chris McKinley, Robin Waity, David Scott Titus, Freya. Uh, just uh, accepting on behalf of a couple of teams, so just want to thank the workshop media team of uh, uh, Robin, myself, and Chris, and the uh, uh, also editing team of Phoebe and Dave Titus, who everybody did a great job there, and also really thank the uh, Freya team who did uh, just so many, it was our first uh, distancing sessions that we did during COVID for visual effects, they were super patient, want to thank Rona, Athena, Kristen, Camille, and Marina. Like, what a great it, teams. It's all about teams, whether it's work teams or home and life teams. Uh, hope everybody had a good recovery. <laughs> the nominees in the category of Best Picture Editing in a Short Drama are Braden Oberson, Deeper I Go, Eric Anderson, Eva Goes Viral, David Scott Titus, Freya, Josh Aries, Mr. James is Dead, Haley Swatsky, The Taylor, Ashley Lynch, Tsunami Falls. And the Leo Award goes to Josh Aries, Mr. James is Dead. Oh, see. Oh, my God. Ah. Hey, hello, everyone. Uh, thank you so much for enjoying Mr. James is Dead. I want to thank all my friends and family. I want to thank uh, my mom and thank Crazy Aid Society for giving us this opportunity. I'm so grateful, thank you. And I just wanna say while I have this platform right now, speak your truth, live your truth, and make good art, as uh, my fellow nominee over there said. <laughs> thank you so much, have a good day. Woo! Yeah, baby! The oh nominees in the category of Best Cinematography in a Short Drama are Liam Mitchell, Cake Day, Alfonso Chin, Freya, Jeff Zwicker, Itsy Bitsy Spider, Ramsey Fendel, Lucid, Mitchell Baxter, Mr. James is Dead, Marco Boso, Andy Brown, Pelican Milkshake. And the Leo Award goes to Jeff Swicker, Itsy Bitsy Spider. The nominees in the category of Best Screenwriting in a Short Drama are Philip Thomas, Cake Day, Michael Bidler, Deeper I Go, Eric Anderson, Eva Goes Viral, Rona Rees, Freya, Peter Hoskins, Mr. James is Dead, Brianna Rayner, Old Fox, and the Leo Award goes to Peter Hoskins, Mr. James is Dead. <laughs> I'd like to thank the Crazy Aids Film Society for being such gems. I'd like to thank my creative cast and crew and everyone who helped us make this, along with my mother, I love her dearly, the Lucid cast and film crew. Uh, they're there as well. It's just great working with you guys. I love you. The nominees in the category of Best Direction in a Short Drama are Philip Thomas, Cake Day, Michael Bidler, Deeper I Go, Camille Hollett French, Freya, Deanna Milligan, Lucid, Daniel Irving, Josh Aries, Mr. James is Dead, Natalie Thoreau, The Taylor, and the Leo Award goes to Camille Hollett French, Freya. Uh, um, okay. <laughs> uh, 
wow. Um, I, I, I said this wouldn't happen. Um, th thank you to the to the Leo Awards and to everyone involved in making this film. Uh, it it was an incredible ride, and um, like Jason said, the first time we've done anything remotely at the beginning of the pandemic. And uh, I, I just want to thank an incredible team and so proud of everyone who was nominated from our team and all the nominees tonight. There's just so much to love and appreciate. And uh, I'm really, really grateful. And uh, don't remember, don't forget uh, where we are and where we come from at the moment and the um, just the ability of the land that we get to work on. And uh, thank you. This is proof that when everything is hard, if you just cling to your love of the art, then amazing things can happen. Thank you. The nominees in the category of Best Performance Male in a Short Drama are Cameron Crosby, Cake Day, Hiro Kanagawa, Deeper I Go, Toby Hargrave, Hunter's Cabin, Peter Hoskins, Mr. James is Dead, Simon Longmore, Not Your Average Bear, Hiro Kanagawa, The Tailor, and the Leo Award goes to Cameron Crosby, Cake Day. The nominees in the category of Best Performance Female in a Short Drama are Rona Rees, Freya, Brittany Wilson, Meeting, Sophie McBean, Pelican Milkshake, Sarah Canning, The Quieting, Matreas Garwinner, This is a Period Piece, Jennifer Pilak, Witchcraft, and the Leo Award goes to Rona Rees, Freya, I'm <laughs> so very excited and grateful for this honor. Um, if you're not getting the roles you want, fucking write them yourself. Uh, thank you to everyone who contributed to prayer. Camille Hollop French, Athena Russell, Kristen Stilling, Shane. I just am so grateful this was a team effort and uh, a dream come true. Thank you to the Leo Awards. Love you all. Mwah! The nominees in the category of Best Short Drama are Cake Day, Philip Thomas, Spencer Foley, Producers, Deeper I Go, Paula Dale, Jess Copeland, Nash Dudstamathea, Michael P. Vidler, Producers, Eva Goes Viral, Eric Anderson, Eva Plashenska, Producers, Freya, Athena Russell, Kristen Stelling, Rona Rees, Will and Lung, Shane Savage, Producers. Hunter's Cabin, Victoria Burkhardt, Nassi Van Herden, Producers. Lucid, Deanna Milligan, Ramsey Bendel, Claire E. Robertson, Producers. Mr. James is Dead, Louisa Muniz, Aaron Musselam, Paul Armstrong, Producers. The Taylor, Natalie Thoreau, Andy Alvarez, Mike Johnston, Producers. And the Leo Award goes to Freya, Athena Russell, Kristen Stelling, Rona Rees, Will and Leung, Shane Savage, Producers. Thank you so much to our entire cast and crew. We could not have made this film without you. We must thank the Hill Greenberg Fund, Creative BC, and the NFB for allowing us to make this film. And we would be remiss if we weren't also recognizing the other people nominated in this category. We could not be in greater company, and we are so <laughs> thankful to be in this BC independent film community, of which we are so like supported <laughs> and encouraged by and inspired by. So thank you. Thank and also land acknowledgement to the Squamish, Swilatu, and Muscium nations, of which the we create and and thrive on their unceded and traditional territory lands. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> what a wonderful celebration of British Columbia talent. Congratulations once again to all the nominees and award recipients. Thank you, and until tomorrow, good night.